Daniela asks, how can I keep my 13 week old Aussie entertained while I'm working from the home office? She's pretty well behaved, but I hate leaving her alone. Now, this is a really common thing that we hear, mm. Danielle. And c- can you fire uh, away on that one? Yeah, and for sure. Stuff. Um, so keeping them entertained at home while you're in the office, you know, when you're at home, it can be really easy to let the dog you know, sort of be free all the time. But if you're busy and you're doing stuff, it, you know, think about what your puppy's doing to entertain themselves. You know, if we want to let the puppy have some free time, typically we try to do it at a time when, you know, we're not um, really invested in paying attention to something else. Or I might get a Kong or I might get a bone and put a long line or a leash on, you know, pull the bed, a dog bed close to where my feet are, step on the leash of the line so the puppy has sort of a small space to roam around. And uh, see if the puppy will just learn to chill and lie and chew on their bone or play with their Kong. And if a few minutes go by and the puppy's just really busy, I'll either... um, you know, get up and address it, or I'll just put the puppy in its crate for a little while, set, take them up for a pee, and then maybe try again a little bit better, because I do want my puppy to learn to chill when I'm in the house, and then I might take a break from work and go and do some training. I might do some tricks. I might do some things that really stimulate the dog's brain. I might do some tugging. I might do some retrieving, things that are active, and then usually the puppy's pretty relaxed. Make sure you give them a good uh, potty break, and then bring them in and either pop them back in their crate or revisit the chilling out on the bed at your side again. Now that the dogs, you know, exuded some energy and used their brain, um, that's sort of what I would do. Honestly, when we're at home and we're working in the office, though, um, if we can't give the dog full attention, we will just pop the puppy in their crate for a little while and then just take breaks. Often, take the pup out, walk yeah. them, interact with them. Do what a, some what training. a great way to break away from yeah. whatever you're doing, <laughs> writing best, emails best or whatever. Oh, it's, yeah, puppy it's play, great. Yeah, uh, and then put them away. And as the dogs get a little bit older and they start to get more training, you'll find you have to do that less and less because the dogs will have the ability to kind of chill out and go and lie down and relax until you're ready to get up and do something with them. But sometimes that can be really challenging for a puppy in 13 weeks that's really yeah. young still yep. so i would just do it in really small spurts so uh i want you to focus on quality time not quantity of time and you'll see all of our trainers um we have a lot of puppies at, at the at the we training do. hall right now like so a lot puppies. of puppies but what you'll see is those trainers will get that dog out and they will do something engaging interactive something uh you know training or exercise or something with that dog and then the puppy's ready especially at 13 weeks the puppy's ready to have a rest yeah so uh you know work your butt off have some fun we have a so many puppy training videos here on the YouTube channel that um, that you're going to find super helpful. You'll be able to do some of those exercises, pop the puppy in their crate, go back to work for a little bit. Um, you know, maybe preemptively uh, go back to the crate and, and get your puppy out again and take them out to go pee and, and start the training session again. But breaking it up with the crate is so, so helpful. Now you've just watched some content from our main channel, McCann Dog Training. And if you'd like some more training information on this topic, click that card right there. If this is your first time on our Clips channel and you really enjoy the short form content, make sure you subscribe. Hit that button right there. On that note, I'm Ken. Happy training.